quick dev tip. Did you know that you can disable Blueprint nodes without having to disconnect them? If you come up to Editor, Editor Preferences, we need to head down to the Blueprint Editor section, head to the Experimental bit, and then do the drop-down. We're going to see this guy here called Allow Explicit Impure Node Disabling. If we turn that on, it means we're going to get some extra settings. So if you'll notice, we have these two nodes here, two print strings, print one and print two. If I play, you can see those in the top corner. Now, if I right click, now that we've turned that setting on, this bit is a new section here. So here, disable, do not compile. And if we play, we're no longer getting the first string. We can also re-enable it. So if we right click, we can see the re-enabling options here. Enable compile, always in development only. If we do always, that means it will always print. So this is interesting. If we look at these two print strings, which were originally the same, this one has development only, this one has nothing. So what this means is basically this one will print all the time. But if we right click, enable compile, go to the development only version, that's only going to print in development versions. I haven't used this a lot myself, to be honest, but I can see the value in it for testing things and trying to track down where bugs are coming from. So for example, if I have a couple of functions in a row, something's causing me some problems, but I can't quite work out where from, I can come in, disable it, and then play it and then see what happens. So this seems to be exactly the same in the early access version of Unreal 5. If we notice, if we right click, this menu doesn't have the options we need. So if you remember, we need to go to Editor Preferences, go to Blueprint Editor, come down to the Experimental section, allow explicit impure node disabling, close that down, don't need to restart. And now we can easily get to our disable. So I like this a lot because in theory, you don't have to do this and then keep reattaching the nodes that you need.